This is Pegasus Launch Control at T minus two hours and counting. Preparations are underway for the launch of the Orbital Sciences Pegasus XL rocket carrying NASA's New Star spacecraft. The call to stations for the launch team was at 7 a.m. this morning, and the launch countdown began at 7.30 a.m. Eastern Time at T minus four hours. The time from the L-1011's departure until the drop of the Pegasus rocket is 60 minutes, and the launch window available to us today is four hours in duration. Weather-wise, we have no significant clouds or weather. The forecast today calls for only a 1% chance uh, or even less, so almost no chance of having a launch weather issue during our countdown today in the uh, Dropbox location. So at this time, from a weather standpoint, we are completely green. The University of California at Berkeley is responsible for the operation of the spacecraft, and the California Institute of Technology, or Caltech, is responsible for the mission science. Both the Pegasus XL rocket and the New Star spacecraft were built by Orbital Sciences Corporation. This will be the 41st launch of a Pegasus rocket, the 13th for NASA. And this is the third launch for or from uh, Kwajalein Atoll in the Marshall Islands for NASA's Launch Services Program. And launch team, this is LC on uh, Countdown Net. L1011 is rolling for taxi. This completes the engine start and pre-taxi checklist. And we've got wheels up, the launch team will go ahead and check step 116 complete. That completes the pre-takeoff checklist, currently in the climb cruise checklist. Thin batteries on my mark, three, two, one, mark. Starboard now, port now, LCRSO, rudder now. Thin sweep now. LC is go for launch, PLT confirmed. T minus 15 seconds. Pilot is go for launch, T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, drop. And Pegasus is away. Standing by for ignition. And we have stage one ignition. Ignition of the Pegasus rocket with New Star for an understanding of the ultimate destinies of our stars and galaxies. Fin actuator system operating nominally. Fins following commands and controlling the flight of the vehicle. Power bus is strong. PDU is enabled. Vehicle flight path is nominal, flying the normal trajectory. Stage one set. We have stage one set. Stage two ignition confirmed. Stage two ignition. Stage two separation. Uh, 11 seconds to stage 3 ignition. Attitude remains nominal. Stage 3 status good. Stage 3 ignition. Attitude nominal. Stage 3 TVC performing nominally and controlling the flight of the vehicle during the stage 3 burn. Payload separation. New star separation from Pegasus. New Star reports that the spacecraft has been acquired via TDRS. And we have confirmation that solar array deployment has been started. Uh, stand by. The uh, generation of the state vector message is in work and uh, will be transmitted as soon as it's verified. And uh, we've uh, gotten confirmation through the spacecraft team. They've got uh, a uh, good lock on the uh, with the TDRS spacecraft, and the spacecraft is uh, still uh, re reorienting, uh, re getting ready to point uh, fully into the sun point attitude. But uh, at this point, it uh, seems that we have a uh, 
uh, had a successful launch. So this will conclude our launch coverage for today. At 26 minutes, 17 seconds into the flight of the New Star spacecraft, this is Pegasus Launch Control.